It was the night we'd all been waiting for. Craig Kowalski and Dan Green would lead out the Nottingham Panthers. Kowalski, though, was to have a big night and a big say. The Sheffield Steelers, Steeler Dan, we were already a big crowd in the House of Steel, but it was the Nottingham Panthers that got off to the better start. A tight first period, it looked like it was going to be scoreless, but then a horrible end to that period. David Lean worked his magic, and Bruce Graham goes over the glove of John DiCaro. We're in the 18th minute, the Panthers led by a goal to nil. It was always going to be an important first goal, and Ling was to weave the magic once more. A nice finish, a power play goal with Fatter off for tripping, and the Panthers led 1-0. Things were to get worse just over a minute later. Jordan Fox throws one through traffic. DeCaro can't find it. And the Panthers didn't lead one. They led two going into the first break. Ling again with an assist. So did Bruce Graham. The Steelers needed a reaction. They got one. Chris Frank challenging Guy Lapine. Lapine was more than... Willing and the two tough men went toe to toe. Lapine standing up for his team, Frank trying to get some momentum going. Lapine, the height, weight, and reach advantage, but Frank with that big heart throwing everything he got into Lapine. He had every one of us standing up, cheering him on. You could tell exactly what Frank was trying to do. He was trying to get some emotion into the building, some life into the Steelers. They were 2 0 down. What could he do to help his cause? He got a rousing reception as well. Steelers had their chances. It kind of worked as well. Legui going close. Kowalski was huge again though. Time after time, Kowalski coming to the Panthers' rescue. Steelers on a power play. Matthew Myers was in the penalty box. But as you'll see here, Galavan's long pass. True Fatter goes to get it. Matthew Myers out of the penalty box. Is there contact between Myers and Fatter? Fatter certainly thought so. Myers centers a pass and Lakovic makes it 3-0 to the Nottingham Panthers. 26-41, Matthew Myers with the assist. The Panthers fans are in second heaven. Was the contact there? It was minimal, but the pass was perfect for Myers. Lakovic fires home. No emotion from young Lakovic. He's just put his team 3-0 ahead. Still, the Steelers came forward. There was hacking and whacking, and we'll enjoy this one. A crackerjack of a fight coming up. Frank's in the middle of it again with Graham. Here comes Fatter and Fox. Fatter's trying to get Fox going. Fox isn't biting. And just when you think everything has kind of calmed down, Keep your eye on Simon Ferguson because Ferguson and Becky go toe to toe. This is one of the great scraps. Big bombs, big bomb coming there from Ferguson. And then they both land haymakers at the same time. That knocks them both to the ground. You'll see it again in a super slow-mo. This is a crackerjack of a fight between two tough men. Again, Becky with a high reach advantage. Ferguson's trying to get his team going. Look how pumped up he is as he makes his way to the penalty box. Trying to get something going for the Steelers. Watch this. Big left hand there from Ferguson, and then they both connect at exactly the same time. Two crackerjack punches that knock both players down to the eyes. What commitment from both Ferguson and Beckett. Was that going to have an effect? Could the Sheffield Steelers get something going here? But it was not to be. Jorgensen gives the puck away, and in front, Lakovic right at the start of the third period. 54 seconds in, Lakovic gets his second goal of the game. It made it 4-0. Was that the Challenge Cup winning goal? The Sheffield Steelers were looking for some momentum. They just had to get on the board. Cometh the man, cometh the moment. Could it be Jeff Legui? It was. He rips one over the glove of Craig Kowalski. The Steelers were at last on the board. Would he provide some momentum? Could they get a second? Let's see it again, Legui. Rips one. Looks like Kowalski's got it, but it's just too quick. It's too hot for Kowalski. He hits the top of the glove and then hits the top of the net. The Steelers had the goal. There was to be no more. It would finish the Sheffield Steelers one. The Nottingham Panthers four after the first leg. Sheffield were ready to shake hands. The Panthers didn't want to know. They were going to leave that till after the second leg. A disappointing end to what promised to be a great night.